Well... I wanted to start this off later, but I accidentally put the link to the down button, so it got covered. So I might as well start there. Hey guys, everybody, I am Super Hyper Energy, and welcome back to more The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Now our delightful MTC button has now been covered as I accidentally put it back on. I wanted to see if I could keep it on for a while without it going back to normal. And now let's skip like a dolphin over here to this location. If it's third day... Wait, what's going on here? Wait, actually, what is this? The fisherman's jumping game. Please ride the boat to the fisherman's island to acquire our plane. Oh, we're supposed to go on this. Alright, go, 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 go. Alright, I'm on this. Get on. Alright. If it's third day, you will get to go over here and play a fun little jumping game. And you will see it with this really buff man. He is here. Get over there. Oh, I know what I'm supposed to do. Never mind. I was thinking, oh, it's just gonna take me over there. Well, it is. But first. Oh, can I make it? Oh, no, I can't. Let's see if we can get on with the uh, Zora mask. I missed the jump. I missed the hint. You're supposed to just. Okay, we can't get up there. We have to do that over again. I'm sorry. Let's just go back over here where it's faster and then come back. I'm such an idiot. I didn't need to do that. Okay. I like when you cure each area, it plays the ri uh, the regular music for Turn of the Field. Now the funny thing about Turn of the Field is that it's an abbreviation for um, something kinda... Well, it means terminate, which kinda in a way means death. So, death field. I mean, this land is going to die. Like, it's been meaning to die for a while, that's why there's this big giant moon coming down. And I think, really, that the process is just... Oh, okay, he's there. I was like, why isn't he there? Did I miss it? But it's the last day. You come over here. I, I don't think it matters that you, um... I get it? Come on. Yeah! Alright. Now that the seas are back to normal, I've started a little business named at Tourist. If you pay 20 rubies, I'll invite you into a jumping game that has a really big prize. If you're up for it, go to the island in the center. Yep. Alright. This is really easy with the bunny hood. Oh, you're up for it. Now then, I'll explain the rules, so listen carefully. I'm going to light the torches on each of the surrounding four islands in a particular order. Jump to the island has the lit torch. If you can jump to it before the torch goes out, you'll get one point. If you get 20 or more points within time limit, you'll get a big prize. It'll cost you 20 rubies for one try. How about it? Will you give it a try? Yes. Great, in that case, I'll start. So just pay, stay in the middle and pay attention to which torch is lit. Which is that one. And this next one is... That one, I didn't even see it. Okay, it's gonna be that one. It's that one again. And it's now that one. This is not too difficult of a game. Just, if you can see it, great. But if you can't, well then, uh, check the other ones. The ones that you can't see usually is the one that it shows up on. Where are you? There we go. See, we're already almost halfway there. 
Oop, I almost went over. Oh dang. Spoke too soon about doing good. Okay. Almost fell off that time. Alright. Mini games are the death of me. Alright, almost fell off that platform. Okay. Alright. I do not want to fall into the water, because that'll be bad. But we are almost done here, and let's just get 21 points. Just to show it in his face. Alright, we are doing good. Sweet. Let's just keep going, because I'm getting the rhythm of this now. Now that I don't need to concentrate, it's just so much more relaxing to just jump. Oh, I get it. Oh, I sh almost fell. I'm getting too cocky now. Oh yeah, he rolled and that's... You're joking. I do that again. Oh! What? If you pay 20 rubies? Okay, that's right. We have to go to the center. I should not have gotten cocky. I should have just stayed put. Uh, and I was right within the time limit. So, we'll have to do it again. Great. Good Golix. And we did it this time, and I'm just gonna stand here and mock him. Now, I think it's kind of funny that uh, you get the sword option in this game. Which could help, I guess, but we have the bunny hood, so... Use the bunny hood, that would be helpful. Um, Uh-oh, that was a little too easy. Oh well, here's your prize. And he gives you a nice golden piece of heart. And I was thinking of saving up to, to buy a big ship. Now it looks like we may go bankrupt. Oh well. Sorry for you. Well, let's head back to Clock Town. Because when we're done with things, we always head there. <clears throat> Sora Clock Town, yes. We're almost done with everything. We just have one more dungeon to do, and then we just have to get all the heart pieces and masks, and then the game is nearing completion. Can I get to that one? I think I just need to go over here. I'm just gonna get to that chest, because it's a good chest. All right. Do do do. We should be able to reach it just fine. Alright. We already know what's in here. A big whop and 100 rubies. I mean, 50 rubies. I was wrong. Well, let's just take our money and put it back into the bank. What's this? You need something? Deposit rubies. Let me take a look at you. And he's gonna remember it's us. Alright, so we're gonna deposit just 185. What really? You're really gonna give me that much? Oh, I'm rich little guy. Alright. Let's see, is there anything left for us to do here? Nope, so let's go back in time. I'm gonna do this right in the middle of an episode, too. Sure. Hmm. Guess we could do this. Dawn of the first day. 72 hours remain. And what's the first thing that we do when we come back? The quickest way to the canyon is through the east gate. Yep, we know that. Oh, okay. Slow down time. But remember when we were back in time, she said that um, to go to the Great Bay. But since we 
just went from Great Bay to Icona, and now we're heading to the dungeon. She didn't remember that part, so... Well, we never went back in time after directly being the Great Bay Temple. So, she reminded of us right when we're about to go into the Icona. That makes sense. And now let's head back over there. And since this, since we head back in time, the Gibdos are back. And the music's back. <laughs> let's try and take that thing out. And now we have more of these statues that we saw the entrance of this place, but there's no Triforce here, but it's flicking, it's putting its tongue between its legs. Stone Tower. This is gonna take a while. So let's climb. That's all that does. I don't think that's helpful right now. Oh, there we go. Oh. Hello, you. The bomb mask. If you don't have any bombs, it can be of help. And I bet you there's gonna be some bombs in here. No, they're not. I know what's gonna be done here. Let's get out this, and let's get out this. Do, do, do. Do. No, wait. No, wait. Uh, no. What was it? It was right, left, right. Okay, it's right. Counterclockwise. That's how I always remember the last part. I go right, left, right, counterclockwise. It was right, left, right, counterclockwise. place another one here. We're gonna be playing a lot of this song here. Now this place is something different. It's very mysterious, I'll say that. Oh that's right. I need to play the the Goron thing. I was being silly there. Alright. We will make use of the different forms we can take while here. But this place, um, as we've already observed, is not to honor the goddesses whatsoever, but it's a tower built to um, worship something else. It's obviously built to get to the sky, but we don't know why quite yet. We know it's meant to be built to go to the sky, but why? All right, and now to complete this, the Zora mask. So do your magic, play your song. But we show it licking the tri- it, we see a picture of something licking the Triforce, which does not show worshipping whatsoever. Instead, oh, this is really weird, but it shows a kind of ghost of hell, like how we died. Now, I forgot to look at Darmani, too. Let's be normal link for this. 
But so far, those don't do anything. Okay, let's head back up here. This is gonna be a long one. But wait, what does that one do down there? Let's check. We're gonna need to do this. But, uh, this place worships something else, and they don't worship the goddesses, but they actually worship are the giants from here, because these people, um, I think felt like they were almost betrayed by the gods and goddesses, so they just didn't depend on them anymore. Something like- this is all just theories, but it's- it'd be easier to explain once we get to the top of this tower, because there are some obvious signs which can be pointed out. What's weird in this area is the fact that you can hear the sound of the re-deads around you. So, at the top of that tower that you see right in the upper hand corner, there is an angry finger pointing to the sky. And if we already know about skies, that's usually where heaven is. So that's even more proof of it being so. Of it, like... Of there being no... Paying attention to the gods, per se. There's more to remember, but... The intent, there aren't any obvious, there are obvious signs of what could be happen, could, like could have happened here, but I could explain it, though I want some of it to be shown at a point in the dungeon that would exp help like explain a lot of it. Now just listen carefully, you can hear the re-deads but they're nowhere to be seen. Where are you going? Oh, they're all over there. Why would I go over there? Wait. I never noticed that. Were they... How long does this go? What happens if I go over there? Huh. The Scarecrow song reoccurs when... I'll have to check back that area sometime, but... That's- okay, I thought they were just in the background. Apparently there are re randomly over there. I wonder what will happen if we can go over there with our mask on. You know. To see the sights, I guess. Oh, there's a fire key setting our way. Where are you? Oh, that's not you. But there's you. Hit the switch. Right over there. Oh, we're too far away. Okay. Now. Alright. And our owl statue. 
good. Now we can save. But I think that's it for today because this was a long climb and it took some time with the ferry. But I hope to... There it is. See you all next time. So bye.